the word of God from the book of Mark chapter 5. We we'll read from verse number 26 until 28. It reads as follows from King James Version. And a certain woman which had an issue of blood for 12 years and had suffered many things of many physicians had spent all that she had and was nothing better but grew worth. She had heard of Jesus, came, when she had heard of Jesus, came and pressed behind him and touched his garment. For she said, if I may touch the hem of his garment, I shall be healed. Uh, by Ingeseri, by LXFM, I'm here to encourage you or to give you the word of encouragement. I always say that what we need as a children of God, it is the word of God to help us to reach where we're going or to get what we want or to have a better life as a children of God. Now, where we have read, we've read a common story about the woman who had an issue or had the issue of blood. The Bible says this woman suffered a lot. She tried to get help from everywhere but no one helped her she went to different doctors but she didn't get help anywhere the bible says one day she heard about jesus uh, the title of my message today is that you need to take a step in the tongue we say take a goza take a step the bible says when the woman heard about jesus that the moment she began to take a step and she said she said this time she said to herself this time i've been trying to do anything i've been trying to find help from from different places from doctors for 12 years but after she heard about jesus she said to herself if i may touch the hem of his garment i shall be made holy there's one thing i wanted to understand here in this common uh, common story the woman here said to herself she did not say to the other people or friends or other people she said to herself that if i may touch the hem of his garment if i may touch the garment of jesus i will be made holy remember first thing before she take a, she took a step is that she had question is what do you do when you hear the word of god every time the word of god is being preached even here at lxfm at your church you see on, on televisions the word of god is being preached what do you do because things are not pro working properly in your life but what do you what do you do after hearing the word of god the bible says this woman after hearing about jesus after hearing the word of god she took a step and she said to herself if i may touch the hem of his garment i shall be made holy and the bible says soon after she went there where Jesus was and she touched the hem of his garment and immediately the Bible says immediately the issue I mean the, the blood season immediately that problem stopped immediately the, 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 the what what was troubling here began to depart from her life I want you to understand something this wonderful morning this wonderful Sunday that what changes what changed the situation of the woman is simply because she took a step I don't know what you want to do in life I don't know what you want to study I don't want to I don't know what you want to achieve but I want you to understand that it won't come to you it won't just come to you you need to take a step there is no way you can pass examination if you're not studying there is no way you can get a job if you're not applying there is no way you can have a better life if you are not putting i mean you're taking a step you need to do something listen to me there is no way your life can change if you don't change some of us today we want our life to change we want our education to change we want our relationships our families to change our church to change even pastors want their church members to change but i want you to understand something that there is no change until you change this woman changed herself she said i've been trying i've tried everything Child of God, I'm here to encourage you this wonderful morning that try Jesus. Take a step and go to Jesus. The Bible says after she touched him, the blood began to stop, began to stop. And the Bible says Jesus stopped. And he said, who touched?